What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. My name is Nathan aka Fearsome Runner 2. I'm going to be showing you how to make your very own FS22 server that is dedicated to you and your friends just like I make the 2020s year server. Now of course I will be using the best server hosting out there G Portal today. You can go to my channel and hit that little button right here that says 10% off on gportal.com and once it loads you'll see this right up here it says thanks for sponsoring. You'll save 10% off your first purchase. Of course ladies and gentlemen the first thing you want to do when trying to rent a server is go up here and rent a server and you'll see here what their most popular games are now of course we'll be looking at fs22 here today so we'll go ahead and click fs22 now you can choose how many slots you want and you can choose the ping now of course y'all can see here that there is different amounts of ping for where the servers are located so it is up to you to choose your best location that matches your server today we're going to go over here and hit create our own server and it will pop up with this right here when you're creating the server if you want a specific amount of people to be able to join all the way up to 16 you can do it if i want seven people if i wanted like 13 people all the way up to 16 i can set that number today we are going to be making a four person server all servers for gportal.com come with one gigabyte of free mod space for fs22 now you can upgrade that to 25 gigs of space if you hit this little check bar here make sure if you want a lot of mods you do that now of course today we are putting a lot of mods in the server so we're gonna hit that little bar now you can also choose how long you want the server to run for when you use my code up here the 10% off you end up getting 30% off of the original price so this is the most bang for a buck but since today is just a demonstration video we are gonna go with a normal 30 day server now we are gonna go through the next process payment now of course it will also show here your 10% discount is applied and you of course will click on which one you want to use I'm of course going to use my pay with balance because Jupiter is nice enough to give me the balance for this. We're going to hit order. And now we're at this screen right here where it says, thank you for your order. Activate your product now or activate your product later. We'll go ahead and select now. Once you have done that, you can go all the way over here and hit the my servers button. Mine would of course be all the way down here at the bottom. This one right here. We're going to hit that button right there. And the first thing we're going to do is turn it on. And while it's turning on, I want to say Gport has been phenomenal about working with me with this. And they have the best customer support out there. If you have any problems at all, they will teach you how to do it better. I had a problem yesterday. They went and fixed it for me. Once you've started your server it may take in a minute first thing you need to do is go to basic and settings and make sure you're using all four slots which currently i am or you're using all your slots that you've paid for if you paid for 16 you make sure you're using all 16 it should but just don't hurt it check anything now this information right here will come in importance later first thing we're going to do is we're going to hit this little web base right here and this will take you to where you'll fully set your server up i'm going to leave the admin password game password you will select which one you want of course when you first start your game you will only be able to add in dlcs you will have to add in mods there is a way to add in mods to this page you go over here select the mods page and you scroll down all the way to the bottom and you see where this is right here it says choose a file you can go here and you'll be able to choose a file and upload them one by one if you want a faster way to upload your mod into your servers listen to what i'm about to teach you go onto your internet browser and look up filezilla and download the correct one you need and then you'll go in here once you have filezilla completely installed you'll go in here and say this one is the host name and you'll just combine them one by one now i will say do not share these with anybody that you may know unless you trust them 110 percent even then we do not recommend for you to share them because this gives them full access to your server to delete anything they want so once you fill out everything right here and you fill it out correctly it'll pop up with this right here you'll hit okay and then you'll see this profile and this is where stuff gets fun mods i have a mods folder set up right here this mod folder will be launching same day as it is inside of my discord so if you would like to get your hands onto this mod folder please go inside of my discord it gives you all your necessary setups to be able to do what you need to do you of course hit Control a and drag them over and now they're starting to download this process may take a second this goes as fast as your internet goes once all your mods are done they'll pop up with this little thing mods are transfer finished and you're officially done with this now you can go ahead and close it and you can open your server right back up and once your server has opened up you can go down here and start selecting the mods you want activated inside your server if you just transfer a bunch of mods into your pack go ahead and hit this 
all button and then you can go through and if you don't have certain dlcs go through and deselect the dlcs you don't want on your server the dlcs will always be here at the bottom of the list then you can hit activate once you've hit activate you can go up here i forgot to hit save earlier so 2023 hit save and then hit start once your server is started take it three to five minutes let it start up properly then you can start searching the name that you've named the server and then you officially made your first g portal server by the way do not forget links down below in the description below hopefully this was a help to all of y'all i know i definitely enjoyed it thanks to g portal for sponsoring today's video